I'm gonna save people so he just wears them up for nominations. You know, Yolanda and Lerato wanted to finish me today. <laughs> Clearly, I never saw this coming. I have never, ever, ever thought in my whole entire life I would ever see Yolanda and Lerato maybe getting along because of something. Actually, today, I am so happy because, you know what, they just caused chaos in that house and I am definitely here for it. I am loving it. By the way guys welcome back to my channel thank you so much for tuning in and thank you so much for joining me if you are new to this channel welcome welcome and welcome please do make sure that you hit the subscribe button you turn on your notification bell you like you comment you share my channel and my videos you also don't skip ads guys please i'll very much appreciate that <laughs> now let me just you so what had happened is this big brother put up a stake like it's some sort of a, a meal actually with steak and potatoes and just like green salad over there and he also he had, he had also written a note that if ever one housemate decide to eat that meal it means that 90 percent of the wager task will be at risk Okay, we'll bet risk or what? Because they have wagered 80%. So meaning that if one person eats that meal, it will be on 90. But if more people eat that meal, it will be on 100. So Lerato came out and noticed that the food was there. And she was like, you know what? It's been long since I ate meat. It's been long since I had steak. And this, this looks really good, you know. And Pale, I think Pale came, um, she was kind of undecided. She was not sure if she wanted to take it or not. But deep down, I think she wanted to take it because how can Pale not want to eat, you know? And Yolanda came along and she was like, my sister, we're taking this steak. Let's go and eat. <laughs> Lirato and Yolanda decided to take that meal and they went on to the kitchen. They shared the meal. They went on they went to eat yolanda was even more and even more selfish she went outside there by the other side to just eat alone at least lerato was busy sharing with the other housemates around you know since they said that if more pe if more than one person eats that meal it means that uh the the wager will be 100 percent guys and i'm like this is crazy like this is so crazy because this one yolanda was busy talking all along when, when she was eating she was like it's the same they've nominated me i'm going home it means that th these people don't want me in this house they want me to go home now they are angry that i took steak and i started eating steak they will be fine <laughs> like she was not even feeling bad at all she was like ah they will be fine these people nominated me it means that they want me to go home they want me to go home. Let me just eat my steak in peace since I'm going home this coming Sunday. So they shouldn't fight or anything. And one person who was furious, one person who was really, really furious, it was definitely Pale. Pale was out there swearing, telling them all their business, telling them that they're selfish for taking that steak because they should have at least gathered all the housemates and asked permission from everyone if they can eat the, the, the steak or not since it's all of their wager and everything. You know, they should have at least discussed this whole entire issue with ev everyone else instead of taking the meat because being uh, what they've done is very selfish and stuff like that they're pretending as if that their wager is just only their own and next week they will be expecting them to participate while they have decided to risk their wager <laughs> guys this one i think all the noise that she was making was simply because she didn't get the food and i think maybe she didn't want to at first when she saw the food she just didn't want to take it because she 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 had to at least maybe 
get her squad like yolanda said yesterday that everything that they do they have to consult each other and then they do it like no one can just do an individual thing you know so i'm thinking maybe she wanted to discuss with one of her closest friends and be like you know what uh this 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 should we go and eat or not because i don't understand her anger each and every housemaid there was just a bit chilled about it. They couldn't say anything. Maybe they're still going to say some things in the corner somewhere, you know, privately. But as for her, she was there swearing because, yeah, she's the mother of the kitchen and the mother of the fridge and everything in the fridge and everything in the kitchen. Now, the Lirato and, and, and Yolanda must kill themselves because they wanted to eat steak. If it was me, guys, I would have also taken the steak because it's the same. <clears throat> the wager itself is not getting along. You understand? The wager itself is not getting along. And that time I haven't ate steak in how long? In a month. So I must now wait and, 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 and wait for other people to be happy with me first. And then I would eat my steak. Ah, uh -uh, nah. I feel like I don't mean I actually, I'm actually supporting what Lirato and Yolanda did. They should open this house, housemaid's minds because you know what? This is a game. This is a game. When someone tells me I'm selfish, obviously in a game like this one, you have to be selfish. You cannot be thinking, you cannot be thinking about other people every time, every single time. You know, sometimes you just have to think for yourself because when you got there and then she, she even went on to say something like, yeah, we didn't come here for you guys. We didn't get into this house for you. That's true. That's right. They, like they also didn't get there for you. They're also not there for you. Because they, they right now they're making their tummies happy. They are also making their their taste buds happy by eating the meat, you know. So I guys, I don't know, but like this drama that Lerato and, and Yolanda had just caused, it makes me happy, to be honest. I am I'm I'm actually happy. I just don't understand why Pale is this furious. It's probably because she's the one who loves food the most amongst all of these housemates. And she feels like maybe she's going to lose a lot from not eating anything, you know. But do let me know in the comment section what you think about what Yolanda and Lerato just did. For me, it's funny. I'm enjoying it. I love the drama. They should actually eat more. I mean, I would vote for them. <laughs> I would vote for them. Just that Yolanda has no idea that this week there's actually no eviction. So she's just there saying that I might as well go home because you know what? You guys nominated me. You don't want me in this place. So why should I still be thinking about you and the wager? Because there's a possibility that next week when that grocery that you're fighting for today is not even there, I'm not even there to chow it, which is true, you know. I will see you guys on my next video. Please do let me know what you think. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for stopping by. Bye.